Ekiti State ha now has a new governor. Biodun Abayomi Uyebanji was sworn in as the fifth democratically elected governor of Ekiti State. Dignitaries in their numbers attended the ceremony, which marked the end of the second tenure of John Kaede Fayemi. Mr. Uyebanji of the All Progressives Congress was declared winner of the June 18th governorship election. Defeating his two closest challengers, Shegun Oni of the Social Democratic Party and Bisi Kolawale of the People's Democratic Party. Ayomidi Ajegbe has details in this report. It was an historic occasion as it is the first time a party is producing successful in Ekiti State. Biodun Abayomi Oyebanji, the Cox the Bon administrator, is taking over from John Kaade Fayemi. The oath of office was administered first on the deputy governor, Munisa de Afuye, and then the governor, Biodun Oyebanji. The governor says his administration is premised on six pillars and gave his word and the massive support of the Ekiti people for the presidential candidate of the APC in February 2022. My mission for Ekiti State is to be a land of prosperity, opportunity, peace and progress. A land in which transformed people and communities can reap the fruit of their labor in dignity, good health, and safety. A land of honor where integrity matters. It is the best position for peace and prosperity under the leadership of Ashiwaju Tinubu, and I'm sure that we will deliver our votes for him. Am I speaking your mind? The presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress, Ashwaj Bola Ahmed Tinubu, in his remarks congratulated the new governor and thanked the people for their support while rallying the people of the state ahead of next year's election. And I'm sure the peaceful conduct of the election, the great results that we harvested, demonstrated what AKC stands for. Another election is coming. My president, you will be ready as the president. Will you vote? Baby, will you vote? You will vote? I will vote. Present at the inauguration are dignitaries from within and outside the state, which includes the former governor of the state, Peter Ayodele Fayoshe, former governor and minister for trade and investment, Otumba Ni Adebayo, the governors of Lagos, Ogun, Ondo, Edo, Plato, KB, Jigawa, deputy governor of Oshun State, and former governor of Samvara State, among others. The people of Ekiti are in high spirits. They want the best. And the governor has promised to deliver the best. Abayomi Ibanji is now under scrutiny. It will be judged after four years. The people of Vikiti are hoping that his administration will usher in not just peace, but prosperity. Ayomide Ajay, TVC News, Ajay Vikiti.